Welcome back everybody. Today's video is going to be a little bit different change of pace type of thing for me because it's not what I wanted to do originally because today's video is going to be a, just kind of me talking because I can't really get into the gym right now because uh, I pinched a disc in my lower back uh, somehow. So I'm pretty sure I'm all good this morning. I did have a lot of other footage that like I was going to do for a separate video, but like same thing here kind of hard to explain but I ended up deleting it all because I was re-watching the footage and I realized that I'm just like sometimes kind of melatonin in some of my videos and I need to kind of amp it up a little bit not be like in your face but just be a little bit more interesting so <laughs> that's kind of the plan uh, I'm just gonna let you guys know maybe like my current bulk and how I'm doing and what I'm planning to do because I'm actually pretty close to being done with uh, my bulk I just weighed myself this morning and I think I'm about 208, 209, and I'll get into that in a little bit. All right, so obviously today, uh, like I said before, isn't really what I planned for. So it's just going to be a little bit different paced video. So I'm going to get ready here, get a shave, shower, and kind of make sure I don't look like an idiot. Because I also have to get ready for work here in a couple hours. So I um, guess you'll get to see me do that, and I'll talk a little bit more here. too much of your time because I know I'm just talking on this video but it's gonna be a little bit different I'm gonna kind of show what I looked like at like the very beginning at like Planet Fitness or at my house you know starting out uh, obviously wasn't the greatest a little bit tough for me to show these just because like I still am self-conscious about it even though I have changed I'm self-conscious about my bulk even though I know it's doing good it's just a mental thing but when I first started out I was 170 pounds 175 roughly and uh, I wasn't really focused on putting on weight. I just, I saw everybody else online, which is how it started, is social media. <laughs> um, I just saw everybody being healthy and I was like, man, that sounds really cool. I want to do that. So I ended up working out for the first time at my place. And then after about two months, I was like, man, this is kind of hard and a little bit tough mentally just to keep doing it by myself because I didn't even know what I was doing. Uh, so then I went to Planet Fitness, which is, it's all right. Uh, just to like start out, I think it's good if if you need some place to go. Uh, I'm not going to dog on it too much just because it's really just a matter of preference in gyms. That's not what I'm talking about. That's where I started out gym-wise, and I was I was just doing cardio a lot. I did like, you know, I'd run like a mile to two miles every day, and I would obviously do some weightlifting just to kind of keep myself going. But I actually started really enjoying it, and I wanted to put on weight and mass. So I like, I was seeing all these videos on social media, which you shouldn't get to uh, and drenched in social, wow, and drenched in social media because a lot of what you see on there is, you know, altered or made to kind of help that person look bigger than they are, you know, stuff like that. Like, it's just all like lighting and that. So don't get like discouraged if you see anything like that. Just don't, don't worry about that. You need to worry about yourself. But, uh, yeah, whenever I first started, I, I was just focused on doing my own thing and I still am. So current progress right now, I just went down and weighed myself, like no clothes on. I'm about 207.6, so pretty good. I might have to cut the bulk a little bit shorter than I wanted to because I'm this close to the end and the tubs of mask that I buy are like this tall and like this wide. I just don't want to have like a bunch of extra mask or sitting around after I reach what I want to because mom definitely wouldn't be happy if I kept going. She doesn't like it as it is because I'm eating everything. <laughs> I don't like it as it is because I'm eating everything. It's really tough to just keep inhaling food. But I'm basically here at the end. I'm going to finish up this mask gainer and probably start my cut. So I'm going to have to start keeping uh, track of my weight and what I eat more often. So that's not what I'm looking forward to, but it'll be worth it in the end. So it's going to be a long cut. But yeah, that's what I'm at right now. Not really sure how this cut's going to go yet. Uh, obviously, I plan for it to be good. But 
I, uh, I just know that cutting and bulking can be expensive and time consuming, which I don't really care about the time consuming part because I, I'm, I just don't care. Like I'm good for meal prepping. Like when I, when I first started working out, that was like one of the first things I ever did was meal prep. I would meal prep like five days in advance and it was actually really convenient because I didn't have to just strummage around for stuff like I am now, but I made it this far. So I want to redo all that over again, hopefully coming with, with a bit of a better plan. Uh, yeah, just don't get, don't get like influenced too much by like social media. Cause if you get like discouraged by people benching like 225 or 315, I want you to know that that is definitely not the average. A lot of people can't do that. I know I can't do that. And I'll say that like a lot of people are like afraid to even share their bench progress or whatever. Cause they think that everybody else can bench, you know, 315, 405 on the normal. That's just not how it is. You know, if you go to your normal gym, there's always like a few people that can, but it's, if you look at the rest of the gym, a lot of people can't. I mean, just focus on you. Do not get worried about what your bench is. You know, that's not even something that should concern you. It's what your body is, what you should be worried about. I, I just want to look my best. <laughs> Actually, me and my friends always joke about that is if you look like you can bench 225, but you can't, that would be better than being able to bench 225, but looking like you can't. It's it's just a it's just a mental thing. So don't get down in the dumps if you know you can't hit something you can. Obviously that's just how a lot of people are, and that's fine. But it'll be all right. <laughs> Alrighty, well that will bring me to the end of this video. I'm sorry if it's not what you were expecting because it's not what I was expecting either. Uh, I should be back into the gym within another day or two. I'm hoping tomorrow because that would be fantastic. I want to hit a push day, and that's what tomorrow would be. But obviously you shouldn't you shouldn't risk. Uh, hurting something that needs to be healed but I think tomorrow I should be good and I'll actually be able to start you know shooting a, a video that I wanted to do <laughs> and uh, hopefully that's that's what I get to do but uh, thank you guys so much for watching Whew. little shirts for the win anyways thank you guys again you're amazing I hope you enjoy this and uh, have yourself a great day or night wherever you are bye bye